Ladies and gentlemen, dignitaries, honorable special guests, welcome to our party. We are here to raise awareness for STEM education, but we're also here to celebrate the great achievements of this company. And we're gonna do that in a couple of ways. First of all, George just reminded me that we set a world record as a company for shipping wireless routers in this quarter. So congratulations to you, Credit Point. But we're also here, you want to say a few words about that, George? I didn't want to steal your thunder. And don't forget, uh, David's in marketing. I'll leave it at that. Where was I? <laughs> David Rush is going to attempt to break the world record for the longest duration juggling of three objects blindfolded. Now, I, I don't know about you, but if you, you might just try this. You can close your eyes and just try and pass your beverage from one hand to another, and chances are you're probably not going to be able to do it very well, at least depending on where you're at in the evening. But, I, so, this, I, my hat's off to this guy right here. Uh, we have official witnesses. We have an official time clock. Uh, we have special guests here. David will introduce them. And uh, you're welcome to come up, but we do have, in order to be official, we have to record this, so please don't step in front of the cameras. When he breaks the record, try not to bump into him when you rush the stage. Uh, so with that, from the snows of Mount Kilimanjaro to the plains of Kansas, from the South African seas to the Serengeti, David has juggled. He's juggled his life. He's juggled balls. And so without further ado, I'd like to introduce the master of material manipulation, Cradle Point's very own juggling Jedi, David Rush. Thank, thank you, David. Yeah, I, I am passionate about STEM education. So the goal today is to raise uh, awareness and promote STEM education, science, technology, engineering, and math. And I've had the opportunity to, to blend juggling in with many of my scientific pursuits as well. I really got into it when I was at MIT, started the juggling club there. Uh, one, of my, one of my projects that we did was a virtual juggling simulator. So it was basically the Xbox Connect five years before the Xbox Connect, you could juggle virtual balls on a screen. Uh, the professor said we should patent it and do something with it. My, my roommate or my friend and I said, nah, we won't deal with that. We Maybe we should have. Um, so I, I, I am wearing uh, some material here representing the two schools that prepared me for my STEM uh, uh, career here. I went to MIT and then Boise State. And I want to say thank you to uh, Bob Custer. He gave me the shorts earlier today. And then he walked by, so I get to thank him in person. Um, and then we are here at Cradle Point, one of the fastest growing technology companies in the state. Super exciting, great place to work for. We, have, we find some of the best employees in the state. And yet one of the things that's keeping us from going faster right now as a company is finding qualified STEM field applicants to fill our positions. And so uh, that is kind of one of the goals here is to raise awareness for STEM education. And so just the way this is going to work, it's, it, it is a Guinness World Record uh, for longest duration juggling three objects blindfold. The current record is uh, six minutes, 29 seconds. Uh, it stood for a little over four years right now. It's held by a guy named Niels Dunkier. Uh, I got to meet him earlier this year, and then I sent him a note saying, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to beat your world record. And so what is going to happen, I've, I've got a, a few witnesses here. It should be called Guinness Book of Fill Out the Paperwork to Prove You Did It. Uh, and so what well, you've got uh, Chris Parsons here videoing it, second video camera. We've got uh, Lori Turner on the video. And I've got three, uh, three official witnesses. We've got Dr. Amy Mall. She's the Dean of Engineering at Boise State. Uh, we've got uh, Jay Larson. He's the president and founder of the Idaho Technology Council. And then, uh, oh man, Janie, Janie Potter from the Idaho State Board of Education. So they're the three official witnesses making sure these are real juggling balls. That mask is really going to blindfold me. Uh, and then we've got official timekeepers. We've got Jack from the YMCA. He also brought this clock around. And then Jeremy Kramer, who some of you may know, he's also a, a track coach. So they're going to be the official timers, uh, videographers. And then assuming this happens, we're going to send it off to Guinness, and they'll give me a certificate in four months or so. Um, so one of the questions might, do you only have one shot at this? Fortunately, you get multiple shots. If I mess up, I can, try, I can start over and try again. Uh, if, if, if I make it to six and a half minutes, 
I'm going to keep going to see how long I can go. But if it gets to 10 minutes, we'll bring the band back up on stage so they can play behind me so we can have them moving as well. Um, if I mess up two or three or four times, I'm going to keep going until, uh, until I get this thing. Uh, or until you guys all leave and say we're done with this. All right, so uh, here we go. Thank you. 